Oh, so out of focus. Hey. Hello. How are you this evening? Although I cannot read Arabic. Hello, HK. HK, we have an Arabic visitor in the room. Uh, hello, Kay. How are you? I'm on the webcam tonight. Hello, Jaden. How are you? I still don't understand the whole valley. Well, we're going to try to understand a little bit about it. I'm oh, I'm confused about it just as well as everybody else is. Um, hello, Shirley, Russell, Stephanie. Um, thank you, HK, for being here to translate. How much of a delay is on this thing? Wow. Can everybody hear me okay, though? Because I've been playing around with the uh, speakers and everything. Uh, great. I'm glad you were good, Jaden. Uh, I didn't get a chance to play the valley. Well, uh, I had some images I wanted to load up, but I didn't get to them. Uh, why is the camera too bright? What is too bright? The video cam? Or sounds good, but you're gray. Oh my gosh, I shouldn't be gray. <laughs> uh, I, I have a new webcam. I'm going to play around that tomorrow if I have somebody that can help me. I look gray. Hmm. I'm gray. Hello, Leo. Well, gosh, I don't know what to do to make myself less gray. Um, I'm going to go in here. You guys tell me when I'm not gray anymore. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me try to set this down. Do I look better? Am I looking brighter? Let's see. Let's go to a setting of 400 and see if that does it. I hear Phoebe doing a little growl in the background. Okay, let's close that. Let's see, am I, nope. Let's see, I'm sitting in a box. That's not going to work either, everybody. I had this set, and then I was playing with the other, the new equipment that I got. Let's try this setting here. Is that better or not? After I do my thing, can I help you on what, Leo? Does it look a lot better now? Ah. Uh, Gosh, there's so many things. Then I will ask to talk with you. Phil, I don't know. I look the same. I didn't change. <laughs> I should always look the same. Hey, guys. I am on my number one farm, and I don't have anything that I can show you guys. There's no difference. It's fine. I, we're going to live with it tonight. I'm sorry. If, if you look, you can see the little box that I'm sitting in. Phoebe, no. Uh, let me find my bark control. <laughs> I don't know why she suddenly decides she wants to bark. Maybe she wants to be on webcam, too. We just like seeing you gray or not. <laughs> well, hello, Peter. How are you? Okay, I'm on my number one farm. And like I said, I did have some pictures. Uh, let me see if I can get those. I don't think I can. Hmm. <sighs> You can, can I stand by for just a second? Let me see what happened with these pictures that I had. It'll be just a moment, okay? So give me just a second here. Uh, let's see. Nope, not that one. I can't load these without you guys seeing everything either. Uh, we'll just have to talk about the... Uh, Valley without the aid of the pictures. Darn, it irritates me now. Okay, I'm back. Phoebe, will you help me with my barn and silo after I am busy? Phoebe, did you get diamonds from the heyday for the heyday bake-off thing competition? Uh, yes, 
I got, uh, I have a thousand diamonds, but I'm not keeping them. I'm going to be giving them away in a stream. I have to first talk with Nick about it. And hold on one second again here, everybody. Let's see here. Just one second. Uh oh. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, I got a thousand diamonds I'll be giving away in the streams and the quantity of 250 diamonds for four people. So you guys are gonna have to watch this and uh, Leo, let's kill let's just chill this until after the stream, okay? Okay, everybody. Uh, well, we can't go into the valley and see what's going on, but here's one thing that we can look at. Since the season has ended and we cannot use our remaining tokens, so what we have to do here is um, I tap OK, it's going to discard my tokens, okay? So let's see what happens now. See the little uh, token barrel that disappeared down there? There's a little that pot that was sitting at the corner of the uh, valley board. Now it is gone because I have cleared my tokens off. So everybody, you need to go and clear your tokens off of the valley. Now, one thing that I have found out about the valley, we're just going to talk about it here, see what we can iron out, is what is your honest opinion, everybody, of the valley? Let's have some questions and answers here. And... Jaden, don't be asking for anything because I'll boot you out in a heartbeat. I'm sorry, but your begging's not going to go over it with me, okay? I'm tough. I had teenagers once upon a time. <laughs> Hello there. Uh, C, how are you? No, I'm, I have not cleared the diamonds with Nick yet. I have to uh, clear with him, and it will be announced at some other time. So just stay tuned to my streams or watch my... I hope to post a video on it really soon, okay? Uh, everybody, what is your honest opinion of the Valley? Let's talk about that. Peter, you like the Valley? You hope they work out the kinks? Yeah, quite a few kinks. So what's your guys' opinion on the Valley? I'm waiting for it here. An honest opinion. You're not going to hurt anybody's feelings or anything. You need to say ex exactly what you think. Leo, you're loving the valley. Hmm. Okay. I don't like the valley. It just doesn't make any sense. Stephanie likes the valley. Anybody else? Okay. I did some a little math on some of it. And... Uh, I think you will like it once you can work out your own strategy for it. And um, I really did dislike it the first two days. And it was kind of fuming. And, hey, hey, what could you be thinking about doing this? But I found out that on yesterday, the last day, that don't rush it. Take time. It, everything resets every 24 hours. Take time in your first uh, first 24 hours and build up your fuel. I found that's the best way to go is build up the fuel. Uh, reset does not mean you lose what fuel you have, but you go back to uh, the quantity of 20 items that you or 20 suns you have to collect in order to um, get more fuel, get another fuel spin. So if you could build up your fuel spins, um, I'm looking at building up my fuel spins for at least two days. But guys, <laughs> they get a little more difficult to, to earn the suns once you pass the 550 mark. I have seen, they said it, you start at 20, and then it goes to 50. Is that right, 50? Then it jumps to 200. 200 to 550, 1,000? Yeah, <laughs> there's gonna be 1,000 in there. And then there's going to be 1,500, oh, 1, and then 2,100. And I did some math on those. And you're better if you just go to the 550 mark, hold on to your fuel, let it reset, then you're starting all over again the next 24 hours at 20, 
and I can't recall, 50, yes, 20, 50, and then 200, and 550. Personally, I'm not going to go over the 550 mark because it's too demanding. And if you're doing the valley along with um, um, doing a derby, you're going to find yourself kind of cramped. Um, if you have, let's say, I saw one person posted that they had to get chili peppers. Chili peppers takes four hours, and it's all just on the planting. You get the um, you get the suns on planting so many of the chili pepper. In this particular case, it was uh, for every two chili peppers they planted, they would get five suns. So that's four hours to earn three hundred and sixty-five um, points towards their. Yeah, strawberries was a hard one. Uh, I think with strawberries, I would. I don't think I'd attempt the 550. I'd just wait for a reset, just keep building up my fuel. Hello, Lynn. How are you? I got to keep wiggling my farm or else uh, air server will quit on me. Let me do my honey here real quickly. So my bees can make more honey. Okay. Uh, if you have the put out fishing nets, which one fishing net would give you 15 points, for 225, see how long it would take you to ever get to the 1,000 mark. Uh, in order to, fishing nets take um, 20 hours, so you wouldn't be able to put out any more nets for 20 hours, and by that time you would have slept in your farm. Your valley would have reset again for you. So you, you need to work out a strategy. And that's something that I've been working on, you know, thinking through it, looking at some past pictures or some screenshots that I saved and um, trying to come up with a strategy of how to do the valley. But it depends on what I have to, you want to see how the normal season is before you say anything. That's a good idea, Peter. Um, I don't know when the normal season will be. There's probably going to be working out a lot of these kinks and everything that they've been having. Uh, some of the things I know is the um, requests are not resetting when they should, so they're going to be working on that. Um, and I think there was a lot of complaints about the trucks breaking down too often. And... Um, and then, you know, if you want to repair your truck yourself, 20 diamonds, that is pretty doggone steep. And it, with all those clouds, you don't know where your neighbors are. Uh, I've tried to go find one neighbor who was broke down and I never could find him. Couldn't find him in the clouds, and I kept scanning all around. I kept going all through like this, looking, trying to get out of the valley or try to see where he was going. And... Just, I couldn't find him for all the clouds. Uh, C says, agree, Peter, task for me reset so fast. That's something they're working out as well. The ta You should not have a reset on your task for 24 hours. And um, like I said, going to, for me, I'm not going to exceed 550 points to build up my fuel. And if you're going to have several days, well, let everybody else <laughs> Let everybody else go ahead and get those chickens, and then you can jump in there after that and start collecting the chickens yourself. I I don't see they're talking it may run as long as three weeks. A se they're calling them seasons, and a season could run possibly as long as three weeks. And um, what what could you do in three weeks? One thing I did find though, but doing this on my number three farm was that. I built up quite a few coins doing that, but that farm was not in the Derby, so you know it wasn't being cramped for anything. But doing the Derby and doing the uh, Valley both at the same time, you got to be very careful because if suddenly you end up with a um, with a task that called for, oh, what's a good one to say? Uh, for putting out nets and unit with the task for doing fishing, it's, that really cramps your style, you know. 
So you got to be really careful about coordinating the valley along with your um, derbies. And we're we're derby focused in my hood. We like uh, we got like what we get from doing the derby. Hey, Carrie, how are you? That's okay, Carrie. Thank you for joining. Lynn, I collected an Lynn collected enough tokens to upgrade her silo. Tokens to upgrade the silo? You mean you bought uh, the what, from the Valley Shop? You bought enough to upgrade? I didn't see enough there to upgrade with. <laughs> Uh, for the amount of work that you have to do in the valley, I am greatly disappointed with the uh, rewards that you get. Uh, does anyone know how to get the chicken out of the clouds? You're going to have to move your truck on the pathways towards the uh, chickens. The more you move into the um, your trucks along the road towards the chicken, the more the clouds will open up for you. Okay. Um, we got any more questions coming before I start jumping in on some of these other things here? Um, we talked, covered, covered some of the items about what you'd like to see for improvements. Is there any really one great improvement that you would like to see? I did like the red box prizes. I got Tom, two Tom cards. Oh, yeah, those were pretty good. You're talking about uh, the sun requirements. Uh, getting the rewards in those boxes there. That's pretty good, too. Um, I need to set something up. Well, hello there, Terry. How are you? Uh, let me set something up here. One little minute, everybody. I uh, want to be on my keyboard here. Uh, uh, just a second here. I forgot to log in on Streamlabs. And that's where I can see when people join. Okay, all right, we're about logged in there. And I am logged in. I was uh, working with um, HK volunteer today to work with me on trying to get my uh, new headset that I got from Heyday, get it to function. We, we've, I don't know if you can say we really got it going or not, you know? So uh, I need to do one more thing here. And we're going to be all set. I forgot to send the link to my dear friend who always wants to be notified by link. So here we go. Uh, there. I sent my link. Now I'm going to close this out. And I'm back again. All right. Um, HK Leo's on his iPad. <laughs> um, I can see the stream on my iPad. Hey, that's fantastic, Leo. I sometimes I wake up when Ricky's on in the early AMs of Friday. I will um, jump on my iPad and go see him. Uh, Peter says, did you see my comment? Okay, Peter, I'm scrolling back up to see what you said. I think this is just a practice run to see the problems that happens and how we will play. Is that the comment you're talking about, Peter? Hi, Sus. How are you? <laughs> Is that the comment you were talking about, Peter? That I'd like to know. Inquiring minds want to know. <gasps> yep. Oh, okay. Uh, this is probably good. The thing, though, about missing a trial run, Peter, was that it was like a little beginning tutorial, self-tutorial. You would learn how to make it work. Listen, I was very apprehensive about this update. I was not was not really as enthusiastic about it as uh, my fellow YouTubers were. Uh, I'm, I have this uh, I have to wait and see attitude and show me. I'm from the show me state, so I have to see. I have to you know you have to show me first. I, right at this time, I don't know when the uh, valley will be up again. Um, well, hello there. Oh, James is watching. Hi, Jessica. Uh, James is Jessica's son, and he usually watches, uh, when she watches the streams, he watches too. That is really great. Uh, let's see what else do I need here. 
Uh, I'm looking at my notes. I made some notes. I asked if you guys were disappointed with this update. Did it meet your expectations? Well, Ma, hello, how are you? Life cam, looking good. I'm looking hot. <laughs> the, the headset really messes up my hair. <laughs> okay, and for those who don't know, um, Terry, I did not set your link up like I said I was going to, too. Uh, but you guys, if you... If you're on a computer, I don't know how you see this on your iPads, but if you put your cursor on a person's name in the chat and you see three little dots, if you click those three little dots, you will be able to uh, go see uh, Terry's channel and you can subscribe to her. Terry is a new uh, Heyday streamer and I really like what she does. She's very informative and she's added voice to her uh, videos now. And I think you guys want to enjoy her just as much as I do. So please go and sub to Terry. I, I know, hey, um, H Cake, is it possible you can get Terry's link and post it for her? I would appreciate it if you could. Uh, one of my questions was, well, hello, Dominic, how are you? One of my questions was uh, to ask you guys about the task requirements to get your sons. To get more fuel, you have to earn the suns to get your fuel spins, as you well know. So do, how do you feel that those tasks were? You think the Derby in comparison to the Valley is better? Uh, yeah, I like I said, we're Derby focused. So we really enjoy our Derby. Peter, I love this update in the Valley. Yeah, the only, like, I, like we're saying, though, the clouds are the big, Thank you, HK. Hey, everybody, there's Terry Slink. Please go and sub, sub to her. Uh, she's going to be pretty good at this game. Yes, sirree. And Terry, I, I believe Terry's level is over 140, so she's been playing Heyday for quite a while, and she can really share a lot of experience and pointers with us all. Uh, I learn from everybody every day. If you quit learning, what can I say? You, when you, when you when a person quits learning something new, I don't know. They're just dead. <laughs> 143, almost 144. Fantastic. The tasks deserve more points or lesser requirements, Alicia. Welcome to my stream, by the way. Um, or lesser requirements, yes. Um, like, for example, I was telling that I believe this was for the 1,000 mark, where the individual, I don't know, it might have been a, this, I have seen the requirements go as high as 2,100. I haven't seen anything over that. And that was not me, because <laughs> I only took mine up to 550, because 1,000 was just too hard to reach. But like I was saying, if an individual has to do so many fishing nets, to earn 15 points, they're going to tie up their fishing. Um, best to wait till after they've done a derby to do this part, or, or to do this part in their um, task for fuel spins. I hope Heyday looks at how we did in the valley and will adjust accordingly. Well, I sure hope so too, Peter. Uh, we've been giving them a lot of input on it, and they have. Uh, They've agreed with a lot of it, so we just, um, I think maybe the next time that they bring the Valley, which will be season, they're going by seasons, everybody remember that. We got seasons, and we got sun, and we got clouds, <laughs> and I don't know if we have rain in there yet or not, but you know rain usually follows clouds. <laughs> anyway, um, if, if you have to put out fishing nets when you, well, we'll send you with rude, rude when you going to do your own streams. Uh, yeah, Wilma, you should you should start streaming. Really and truly, you did fantastic when you did it with uh, Rude. Yes, sirree. I'm sure they'll tweak it. Yeah, I think so, too. Like I said, we don't know when the next season will be, but I think we can expect some changes and improvements. Um, we did tell them that we feel that the requirements for obtaining the sun is just too high. Um, I, 
I think I spent like six hours just trying to get to the 550 mark. Because, you know, the requirements were just too difficult. And you put in, um, the, I think the, one of the biggest difficulties is when you have to do something for the fishing area. If you have a, um, a crop task that takes you four hours, you got to wait four hours before you can do another planting in order to get points. It was impossible to reach 50 chickens for the good prize as well. It's just a trial run. Uh, it's my understanding that there will be more chickens available when they go into the seasons. And if, if you look at it, if there's, they're saying that seasons could be any length of time, even three weeks. If the requirements are still just 50 chickens, we wouldn't have any problem reaching that, would we? You guys think you'd have a problem reaching 50 chickens in three weeks? But then you wait eight hours for strawberries. <laughs> I had tomatoes. <laughs> so I had to wait six hours. And this was on my uh, number three farm, which has, uh, how many fields do I have? One, two, three. I have 106 fields, I think. That took a long time, six hours for them to grow. Hello, Stan, how are you? We won't because in three days we already had 22 chickens. And you think the requirement's going to go higher on those chickens? Alicia says extra sun points didn't roll over. Like if you needed five points left and did a sun test, you lost the five. You watch and be very careful because you do get a little pop-up telling you when you've reached your goal on the suns. Stop right then. Don't do any more because you do. You cannot keep accumulating. You need to go do the fuel and start collecting, you know, spend for your fuel, then go back and start collecting again for another fuel run. Um, like I was, some of you didn't come in early. I suggest that you go ahead and do the first 20. You get a free spin when you start up. Go ahead and do the first uh, 20. Add to that free spin. Go back and do the 50. Add again to more fuel. Go do the 200 mark. Spin again for more fuel. Let your fuel accumulate. Then you can go a lot more distance in the uh, valley. Bye, Lynn. Thank you so much for coming. Wilma does very well on her English when she is speaking. She really does. You know if the gas rolled over the next season. No, the gas will not roll over. So I suggest that when you see that the season is ending, that you burn up all your fuel. It does not carry over. Your fuel does not carry over. Your tokens do not carry over. If you notice when there is the reset on the valley, let me wiggle my farm here again before it freezes on me. If you see that when you reset, it resets every 24 hours. If you've noticed on the reset, your fuel did stay, uh, but your whatever you had accumulated towards sun, say if you were at the 550 mark, whatever you accumulate at that sun does not roll over into the reset. So, you know, uh, try and finish out uh, the suns up to 550 if you can, and then go ahead and spend for your fuel. Then you can start all over again at 20, 50, 100, and then no, 20, 20, 50, and 200. I believe that's the way it went. But uh, you can. this is the strategy that I'm going to be taking. And uh, a lot of you know that I'm fairly strategic <laughs> when I, for how I play Heyday. Thanks for the compliment for my English. You might not spell it correctly, Wilma, but we do understand what you are saying. So don't worry about your spelling, but you speak it very, very well. So uh, anybody else have anything about the valley they'd like to ask questions? Tokens reset at the end of the season. So if your wallet gets full with the tokens, you're going to have to spend some. Um, what about the tasks required to get more fuel spends? We talked about that. And actually, if your truck breaks down, you have to pay. My dog is barking or she's whining. If your truck breaks down, it's going to take you 20 diamonds to start it again, or 
wait for someone to come repair it for you, it does reset anyway after two hours. I'd spend that two hours of building up more suns for more fuel. So you, you'll learn how to how to use your how to you know plan this strategically. I don't like the trucks breaking down either. We did complain about saying that the the trucks break down too often. Uh, you know, I we I don't know. I don't think we did a, a group task. I think we were just collecting the chickens that were in the little round, you know, the yellow round disc on the roads. Um, HK and Jessica, if you're still here, do you recall if we got any of the group tasks done? I don't think Phoebe's very happy. One of the things I'm going to do is get my other webcam set up. Phoebe down in one corner. You guys are good to see Phoebe when we're streaming. Uh, so, Wilma, you got to do a group task. Can you tell us briefly how that went? The map is too big for group tasks. Oh, Stein, I'll agree with you there. I, I don't think we did either, HK. So, uh, but you, you guys can learn. I learned how what strategy I'm going to try to achieve um, the next time the valley comes back again, next season. So uh, Wilma is in uh, Nighthawk's group. So Stein, are you in Nighthawk's group or not? Or his hood? With four or five, we did a group task. I saw uh, Nighthawk did post an image showing that, oh, see that sudden change on my green screen? BB must have breathed on it and caused it to move. <laughs> but uh, Nighthawk posted an image showing that he was up to having to collect 2,100 suns in order to refuel. I saw that and I was like, Oh, my gosh. And I stuttered it. Uh, oh, my, 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 my gosh. <laughs> I, I couldn't believe it. I was hoping that they'd reset where we reached a 1,000. Uh, Peter, if you go in the valley, you're going to be playing with people from other hoods. Um, they are shown, other people are shown by the yellow markers. Well, hello, Tiffany, how are you? Like I said, the other hoods are shown by the yellow markers. Um, you show up with the red marker. And is it the hood? Don't your hood members show up with green, guys? I've already forgotten. <laughs> That's a crazy amount of sun. Oh, my gosh, 2,100. I'd fall off my chair if that popped up. Honest to goodness, I'd say, oh, to heck with this stuff. <laughs> I'll come back when it resets. <laughs> Wilma, we will be waiting patiently. Yes, people from your hood will be in there as well. They are green, yes. Thank you, guys. Uh, so you've got your red, your hood members are green, your visitors are yellow, and... Is it the uh, little blue exclamation point shows where someone's broke down? <sighs> Have been chatting, just got done eating. Okay, <laughs> haven't been chatting. Um, I, I think as time goes on and we play this valley more, that we're going to all start liking it. Because uh, when we figure out exactly what the strategy is, there is a strategy to it. You know, all board games have a strategy. Uh, you know, like when you play Monopoly, you try to go for Park Place and Boardwalk because they pay the most. So I think you'll work out your own strategy in time. Uh, I have to rely on other people, though, because I am in the, on the only one in your hood. Well, you know what, Peter? Uh, you, you would be at a greater advantage if you had more people in your hood or... Ah, oh, Tiffany, thank you. <laughs> um, you'd be at a bigger advantage if you were in a hood with other people. You would be able to collect much more from your derby tasks. Um, gee, I can't think of all the, the. There's really more of an advantage being in a hood with other people. 
So if you, you might want to consider joining a hood or open your hood up to other people to join you, Peter. Uh, Tiffany says I did one group test only because it was right in the middle of a lot of the people, but then there was one way across the board and nobody was anywhere near it. I saw one group task pop up when I was playing in it, and uh, I think it, I don't even remember what it said. I, I should have gotten screenshots and gone through them all here to show you since the valley is not available for us right now. Can't go back to it and show it to you. But if you have, if you see the valley sign, there's going to be a little blue pot sitting right at the corner here uh, where they have the, uh, what do you call that, construction cone or safety cone. There's a little blue pot that sits right there. You need to tap on that and clear all your tokens off so it'll be all ready and set for the next time. We have to do a group task next season. We're going to try. We really will. Okay, does anybody have anything else they want to add on about the valley? I can't believe we talked 36 minutes on the valley. Down in the valley. Reminds me of a song I used to sing to my granddaughter when she was little. Okay, I'm going to do a little work here on my town. And you know what, guys? <laughs> I'm still procrastinating about redesigning my farm. Yeah, I'm really pathetic. <laughs> Let's see what we can do here. And, oh, what do we get? Hmm. No big prize yet, so I guess I'll wait before I spend any of my cards. You saw one building with a chicken, the windmill, but you never could reach it. Uh, all the, I found, I think I hit two chickens, and they were sitting in the middle of the road on one of those yellow circles. And I collected them. And would you believe that the first chicken I saw, my truck breaks down on my way to it? Thankfully, somebody repaired my truck really fast. But I'm wondering if we will all see the same chicken or if we will see chickens in different locations. Like, say, I see a chicken in front of the fish shop. Will one of my teammates see the same chicken or will they see one in front of a house or on the way to a house? The background noise is my dog. You guys can hear her. <laughs> Phoebe, no, no baby. I She probably wants me to hold her. And when I said baby, yeah. <laughs> my dog is named Phoebe, really, and I named my arm after her, so I decided I was gonna stream as Phoebe, and I think I'm gonna have to take myself away for here for just a moment, and Take care of Phoebe. So you guys, bear with me for just a moment, okay? Be right back. Okay, everybody, I'm back. I had to go get her some carrots, and I'm not adjusted in my chair. <laughs> I wanted to hurry back. Okay, let's see where we are here. <laughs> uh, yeah, my dog, I really call her a sporky, which is for a spoiled Yorkie, and trust me, she is so spoiled. And her favorite treat is carrots. And one of those carrots that looks so pretty. So what do you think of the valley? I I think it 
it's going to be good. We need to um, have another season in it. And I think after about the, it depends on how long the next season is. But um, my, do yeah, my dog, her, her treat is carrots. She's fat. <laughs> her, here, Phoebe, want a carrot? Phoebe, here. There, gave her another carrot. Uh, she's on a diet. She has um, like one fourth cup of uh, her dog food with um, like a half a cup of green beans. And I think she is losing weight. <laughs> but she should only weigh like eight to nine pounds, but she's weighing 11 pounds. And for a little dog, that's fat. I always refer to my daughter as her sister. <laughs> and uh, she, my daughter was over the other day, and she picked up her sister. <laughs> and she said, oh, my God, she is so fat. <laughs> She's healthy. <gasps> oh, can I? Oh, I only had two honey. So I could not make those. Let's make the chocolate cakes. This will be for the night, everybody. Do a little stocking up and getting ready. Your dog likes carrots. Yeah, carrots is one of the things that you can feed your dogs. There's a lot of things. Do not feed your dogs grapes. Grapes is very harmful for them because a lot of dogs don't chew it up. They swallow them whole, and it's, it's not good for them. Um, they can eat the asparagus. She loves asparagus. Can you show me how to use Tom? Well, I just ran him, Leo. Uh, here's Tom. And if he was going to, if he was going to run for me right now, a little, you can, uh, when you touch Tom, a box will pop up showing what you have in your barn. It always start out with the lowest number of items you have in your barn, like what to get him for 100 days. No, you get him for 10 days, not 100. He's, uh, if you had Tom before, if you renew it, it's only 90 diamonds to renew. Hi, Leon. Is Leon here? Well, hello there, Leon. How are you? <laughs> yes, Leon. Give us your opinion about the valley. <laughs> Be honest now, Leon. That's what we're doing. We're, we're all being very honest about our opinions on the valley. <gasps> the valley is called the valley of death. <laughs> Leon's not too happy with the valley right now. But Leon, I think if you will learn, uh, learn a strategy on it, uh, I think if you learn a strategy that you'll like it a lot better and maybe the next time you will have a strategy planned for it. Uh, ew, maybe we were talking earlier about what my strategy will be. Uh, Leo does not get how to use Tom. And Wilma says her dog is 50 pounds. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Um, Wilma. I have a thing about big dogs. I always say big dogs sleep right behind big poop. <laughs> and I like the little dogs better. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I had to say that. <laughs> but you can see my webcam is not set properly. I'm still learning. I'm going to, One day I'm going to be a pro. I'll be doing big things. I have 3 million subs and no time at all when I become a pro. <laughs> yeah, dream on. Don't make me laugh. I'm eating. <laughs> what are you eating there, Leo? Let us know what you're eating. You always ask everybody else what they're eating. Oh, I'm still behind on mayo. I can use one there. And I need more bread for sure. Have you guys noticed that uh, cheap wheat's kind of hard to find right now? 
Leo's eating his bagel, everybody. Uh, Leo, do you have any boosters to get time free? You can ask for products that are hard to make or food that is time consuming. Uh, yeah, I told him. That's what she said. <laughs> Terry, I want your autograph. <laughs> Yeah, we joke about this all the time here in the family. <laughs> but hey, you want my autograph? But I told this before that my granddaughter, whoa, ran out of fish there, didn't I? Uh, my granddaughter's classroom was talking that teens, teenagers, they know a lot about technology. And perhaps that their parents know something about technology, but not as much as the teens do. Then they said, your grandparents probably don't know anything about technology. And uh, my granddaughter says, yes, they do. My grandma has her own YouTube channel. And they, what? Your grandma has a YouTube channel? So they spent the rest of their class watching my videos. Oh, I love the viewing time. <laughs> And I hope I got some subs from that, too. <laughs> it was fun, though. She came into the stream one night, and I was telling that story, by the way, when she came in the stream. <laughs> and I said, oh, hi, Megan. My granddaughter's name is Megan. And I'm telling a little story, and she goes, I am your granddaughter. <laughs> I was taken back. <laughs> Phoebe needs to give me her autograph, but I'm afraid that my paper will <laughs> Now, I know you did not Google that pickup line. <laughs> Hi, Bavesh, how are you? <laughs> Shirley told me a while back, don't forget her when I get famous. I'm like, yeah, right. <laughs> the, you know what, Terry, it's... Um, it seems like it takes so long to get that first 100. And by the way, any newcomers here... Uh, HK, if you could uh, put her uh, link back up again. Everybody, go subscribe to Terry if you haven't already. We want to get her up to 100 as fast as we can. But like I was starting to say, Terry, that first 100 seems so hard to get. Then after that, it's like, oh, how did I reach 200? Oh, my gosh, I'm 500. And hopefully somewhere along that line, you'll get promoted by Heyday. And they will highlight you on their page. And then it's just grow, grow, grow after that. I, I stream because I like it. Just, I have fun doing it. I don't have fun showing my face. So uh, Phoebe, my hubby, met Rude last Monday. And he said to me, why don't you stream, Wilma? Well, Wilma, will your husband buy you all the equipment you need? <laughs> I think I have a uh, headset with a microphone that I'm not liking too well. <laughs> I could ship to you someday. <laughs> it says say Supercell on it. I, I'm having difficulties getting it set up just right. Valley next season start. Well, but Vash, you're not too sure when the next season will start. Terry says, I'm sure hoping so, Phoebe. It seems snails. Oh, yes. It is slow, that first 100, Terry. Um, you know about the Heyday Discord. I don't usually post that link. Uh, I, <laughs> I'm not overly fond of Discord, quite honestly. Well, Dwax or Dwax, is that how you say it? Well, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much. Hey, if you guys have not subbed, please hit that beautiful red uh, subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the uh, little bell next to it so that you get all the notifications. Why don't you like showing your face? You're beautiful. I, I just feel more at ease and... I can slouch and be comfortable without my face being up there. Like, I'd like to do this. Uh, like, you know, put my, prop up my face or my head on my uh, hand. Um, see, I, that's what I like to do. I like to be more comfortable. Um, I, I don't stream in my jammies, even though sometimes I don't get out of my jammies until afternoon. <laughs> uh, that's one of the pleasures of being retired is that you can 
if you get out of your pajamas before noon, you're not really in retirement yet. There's uh, Terry Slink. Everybody, please go and subscribe to Terry. I am really enjoying her videos, and I think you will too. So, so let's go. Let's let's see if we can get her up to uh, 100 subs, everybody. Yeah, we did that one night in Ricky's stream for me. Let's see, we did it for. Did they do it for Super Sight too? We both reached 100. Now we were getting Super Sight to 1,000, so we made we helped Super Sight get to 1,000 that night, and then. Um, I reached my first 100. <laughs> Should I subscribe to Terry? I don't know. She doesn't like my highs. Well, Peter, I think you should subscribe to her. Heck, maybe someday she'll have uh, Katie as a guest on her videos, on her streams. Uh, Leo, please. Okay. I can't help you right now unless you want to unload uh, some products to me that I can post for the group here. You want to do that, Leo? I'd accept that. Wendy, yay, Wendy has subscribed. In case you don't know, Wendy is Mom's Diner. Hi, Wendy. Too late, you subscribed to her a while ago. <laughs> but we'll, we'll see if we can get Katie on some night, Peter, and you can bring all your friends to sub to us as well. <laughs> Bribery. I love bribery. <laughs> okay. Terry, did you get your computer yet? She's in the process of getting a new. Come to level 114. Uh, let me finish feeding my animals so I can collect all my goodies here. I love how they poop rewards. Yeah. One second here, Leo. I'm coming. I'm coming. Doing the old lady's walk to get there really fast. Oh, did you see that? Two deeds and a plank. Oh, I love how they pay off, man. Love, love my animals and my town. I can't wait for the next town event. Uh, to get Bims and Sims. I'm going to sporadically video throughout the day and then put it all together in one. You sold a bunch to Ricky. Oh, Leo, let me see what you have here. You're 114 now. Everybody, Leo's leveled up again. I passed you up. You know what? I might not be logged in on Facebook on this one. I passed you up, Leo. You're hiding. There he is. I found Leo. Oh, sometimes I don't like UPS. Okay, let's we'll see what he's got for us here. Well, I don't need those, but I'll pass them on to somebody else in the stream. Ooh, great. Honey toast is a good one to send Tom after everybody. See what all we got here. Yellow paint and drills. Loads of yellow paint. Loads of yellow paint. Whoa, you've been busy painting things yellow. Wow, Leo. This is terrific. Thank you so so much. Hello, Franco. How are you? Ooh, planks, panels. So, who's in there grabbing these? Who's in there grabbing those up, uh, Leo? Leo asked me to come to his shop. Whoever's in there grabbing up Leo's products. Wilma, that was you? <laughs> okay, I'm going to put these back out for sale. Are you done, Leo, so I can... Wilma, we're going to have to unfriend her, Leo. <laughs> I'm going to put these uh, items back out for everybody. If you don't mind, Leo, I'll pass them right back. Uh, it was, they're going to be at full price, everybody, because Leo charged me full price. Uh, yellow, oh my gosh, all that yellow paint. I hope somebody needs it. 
Anybody in the chat need these items? Anybody's free to go. Go back. Oh, Leo. Going back. Whoa. Goodness. What are you, are you hoarding yellow paint? Oh, my goodness. Look at all these town expansion items. Still collecting. <laughs> oh, my goodness, the drills. Ah, I don't need the tape, but I'll take it and pass it on. Oh, my goodness, Leo. See, Leo, these extra things are really absorbing your barn space, and you can't. I'll take the popcorn. Yesterday, I was shopping for popcorn and never did find any. Thank goodness my neighbors came through. I don't need soybeans. Okay, Leo, I'm going to go sell some of this stuff now so people can, no one's buying it? Uh-oh. <laughs> Mom's Honey Dew Farm. I don't need all these items. Now it's a great time for you guys to expand your town so it'll be ready for the next town event. You sold like 300 to Ricky. Wow. I don't need all of these, everybody, so I'm going to pass them on to you. Um, I do need the planks and the panels, so more paints going. Let's see. Oh, tape. Tape for sure. Tape is the one item that I get so much of. You only need hammers and tar buckets. Okay. I think I have two, maybe three more shops to expand in my town. And they need tar buckets too. Oh, so many drills. You know, repeating what Nightbot just said, leave a comment on the videos. I'm going to be doing another uh, promotion where I'm, I will be giving away 250 diamonds, and it's going to be based on comments in the videos. And you, I don't think anyone saw my... Uh, one stream where I had a comment picker and we spun the comment picker and it shows someone from the uh, comments to receive um, a prize. And Jessica won the little sheep, which I haven't sent to her yet because I'm since the shop has closed, Supercell shop, I'm holding on to that little sheep for my husband to take some more pictures of me with it, which uh, if anybody um, noticed, I've been changing my uh, thumbnails and uh, got a little facial itch here, everybody. <laughs> I've been changing my thumbnails and I've been doing poses with some of the animals. You know, I'm a professional model, so why not pose with the animals, right? <laughs> Let's see, what else can we give away here? Uh, some of these things I have to keep. Oh my goodness, at those carrot pies. Oh, I don't need that many. Popcorn I am, whoops. Oh, pass on some uh, honey toast. And more paint. And what else are we gonna pass on here? Hmm. I do not like having too much TNT. I want you to watch this, Leo. I'm selling the TNT because I feel I have too much. 61 is too many. Shovels and picks are what I want. What else can we give away? Oh, let's give away some bacon. And, hey, cream. Hey, look at here, everybody. <laughs> See what we got. Mm -hmm. We can do some milk, too. And Phoebe's not a happy little camper tonight. I don't know what her issue really is.
use the TNT on the valley. <laughs> I'm going to give that to Blossom. <laughs> I, th I think she's collecting all the TNT. <laughs> you know what? I have too many gold ores there, too. I have created almost 500 spots in my barn just selling this stuff off, guys. I need less of those and less of these. Leo, you're buying back stuff that you sold to me? Um, I need the tape, guys. I'm sorry. Just about ready to upgrade my barn. Phoebe's gold. She doesn't need gold. <laughs> uh, HK, I have to ask you. Do you compliment your mom all the time? Tell her how great she is. She's got to be great to be putting up with you. <laughs> well, your mother has a wonderful son. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Helping people out here, I hope. <laughs> Leon, TNT will not work, HK. Valley need a holy priest. <laughs> Leon, <laughs> the valley needs a holy priest. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. That, that is really hilarious. You would blossom together. <laughs> hey, guys. My eyes are watering up. I laugh so hard at that. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> I don't even know where I am putting stuff out for sale. <laughs> uh, you know, these green smoothies are good ones to get because it takes lettuce to make them. <laughs> Crazy. Uh, oh, I got tar buckets. Oh, I need to go check my town out later, guys. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Leon. You are crazy. Guys, I, I've known Leon for a couple of years. We were in uh, Ricky's Hood together. We made uh, silver tops together. And he is so funny. <laughs> Leon, you are just hilarious. <laughs> but, you know, I think that's just about all I want to give up right now at this time. Uh, <laughs> you got tape. I, I just sold some tape. Two. I'm not too sure uh, where I do stand. Okay, you guys, the shop is open if you want some drills. Uh, where is my barn? I need boats. Hey, Leon, I'll take boats. <laughs> you know, funny thing is, if um, Leon's not in the farm, all we got to do is just say, <laughs> Boats were sailing up Pops Leon. <laughs> you guys, hold on just a second. I, I'm laughing so hard. I need to get a tissue. <laughs> Crazy guys, I tell you. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me for that. Leon made me do all that. <laughs> oh, gosh. I hope you guys. Franco, 30 tapes and 30 nails. Oh, what? Franco, where are you? <laughs> uh, I, Franco's leveled up. I know. How many times have you leveled up? <laughs> He's somewhere in here. Didn't you make 100? There he is. I found Franco. Ooh, I can't. Well, why did I grab all those tapes? I didn't want all of them. That's enough. Thank you very much, Franco. Now let's see. I just need bolts, I think, now to take my barn up one more time. 30 bolts. I'll rob one of my other farms for that. <laughs> 10 blankets and grab them, Leo. <laughs> it's only 10,000 coins. You can afford it. <laughs> 
I guess I should go bar hopping here. My friend's bar is bar hopping. <laughs> it's really kind of funny because I usually start out with uh, hitting uh, Greg's farm first, but now he's a Greg leveled up. Guys, in case you don't know it, Greg leveled up. He usually has good sales. He has nothing. What did that guy have back there? Ten cent wheat. Ooh, that that's uh, rude. And I'm gonna take it because I need to make some hay bales or wheat bales, wheat bundles. They look like bells. <laughs> Thank you, there, Nighthawk. You got a lot of blankets because you just use time. Wait a minute. Is this kind of contradictory? I got a lot of blankets because I just used Tom for it. Why are you asking me how to use Tom? I don't understand that, Leo. Don't understand you. We're be oh, Wilma. Wow. Thank you, Wilma. Were those for somebody else? Wilma. Were the screws for somebody else? Because they are, I'll put them back. I'm waiting for Wilma to tell me. Let's see, it's 20, 33 screws. This guy has some good sales. Wilma, I grabbed those screws. Were they for somebody else? I didn't see it up there. HK, what are you doing? HK leveled up again today, too. Congratulations, HK. Come to his shop. Ugh. What are you doing? Oh, my gosh. Look at this. You guys are spoiling me. Honest to goodness. I don't need the milk, HK. You guys are spoiling me. You can't be doing this. Uh, Wilma, who were the screws for? Go grab my nails and tapes. I think I did grab them. Gosh, guys. I'm, I'm so used to working for everything. And let's see, I was last at Wilma's. HK at my tag, please. Okay, let's get back to Wilma. Let's keep on going through here. Look at that, guys. I missed all those, didn't I? This is one of my hoodies. Macklemos. Okay, Wilma. Ooh, look at this. Gray stones I need. Nice. Oh my goodness, look what I got. Yay, 10 cent wheat, or 10 corn wheat. <laughs> hmm, that's a nice sale, everybody, but I don't need all that, so I won't be selfish with it. I'm not too sure, but I think that's Ruchicons. The AEH is Ruchicons. I need those shirts, I really do. Leon's waiting for boat and planks. Okay, Leon, I'll see if I can help you. Here's Greg's. Look what Greg has given us, guys. Indeed. Indeed. I always take all his stuff. <laughs> Greg has been kind of generous lately. Uh, thank you, Jessica. Thank you very much. Leon needs hammers. I don't need wool. I like going to, I like bar hopping here. <laughs> Let's see, that was Jody's. I'll have to check back later, see if I need any of her wool. Um, this is Terry's farm. I don't need eggs, I don't think. If I do, I know where to find them now. <laughs> Phoebe, check town. Check town for saving some for Hoob and his farm.
Da -da. Ooh, look at here. Rampage has got lettuce for sale. He must have done a task for fuel. That's what I had was lettuce. I want the corn, popcorn, because I had two boats call for that. And I had none left after that. I heard that Greg gives everyone an individual audience, depending on what how they feel she could use. I don't know if that's how they do it or not. Look, Russell, thank you. Uh, you know, I do want these. Uh, I don't think this farm did lettuce. I'll go ahead and take some. Uh, but this, I'm from the USA. The state I live in is Missouri. And Missouri is known as the show me state. And I am a true show me type person. Uh, I think HK has been trying. Oh, look at here. Thank you, Lucretia. Thank you so much. Are they cheaper? Nope, full price. Uh, this is Rude again. He's got lettuce for sale. Anybody wants to go get Rude's shop if you're on his friend's bar? Because you know how long it takes that lettuce to grow. These can tell who all had lettuce on their tent on their valley. Oh, did you see all that? Look at all those axes she sold. Wow. Uh Leon, I think HK sold it because he didn't need them. Oh look. I know I'm hogging up that popcorn. Probably have enough now. Hmm. I was growing tomatoes, so I am going to take some tomatoes. That should be enough. I can always pass them. Oh, Daisy, Daisy. Oh, I love Daisy. Look at this, everybody. <laughs> you would think I was opening Christmas presents. I don't get excited about Christmas presents. I get excited about goodbyes. No. <gasps> Franco! Thank you! I'll see what I what I don't need, I'll pass on to the stream here. <gasps> Looky here! Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh, what are you guys doing? Is this all for me? I'm running out of coins, getting low here. Thanks, Suze. Thank you 100%, lady. Look at that. You guys, just making my night. <gasps> Better powder, there goes my heart. <laughs> oh, I am. I'm getting all excited here. This doesn't happen too often. This is Luke Baker's. I don't need anything from there. Oh. <gasps> Thank you, Igor. I like that one. Hmm, I don't need anything from Albini. Albini, Albini. You need anything, you know where to find me. <gasps> well, Jack, thank Phoebe, come to my shop. Jaden, I don't know if I have you on my friend's bar or not. Ooh, diamond rings. Diamonds are a girl's best friend, believe me. Yeah. Level 43 is Jay's farm. Okay, give me. Uh, I'll be working my way down to you there, Jaden. So just hold on, okay? Just, oh, there was some broccoli. Just one, but I'll take it. I'm not greedy about that. <laughs> That's called store hopping. I call it bar hopping because it's a friend's bar. So I call it bar hopping. <laughs> bar hopping actually is uh, people who jump from tavern to tavern. 
Phoebe is a diamond. You can't find a better diamond. Oh, HK, you're just so sweet. I need these. Now I don't have to plant them. Sorry, Daryl. I hope those weren't meant for somebody else. If they were, he'll be unfriending me again. <laughs> Look, look. Oh my gosh, did I ever pick a good time to go bar hopping, everybody? Whoa. I tell you, HK is so doggone nice, people. He really is. I've got to know him quite well. And uh, he's just the ideal son for every mother. Uh, let's see, I'll take the ice cream. This is Black Bear's Farm. Oh, this is fun, guys. Can I have to hold on, guys? Oh, I'm all right. What's your level, Bavesh? I don't know if I have you on my friend's bar. I gotta go find Jaden here so he doesn't have a heart attack. <laughs> I'm, I'm coming quick. Level 43. Coming, coming, coming. Where is level 43? Okay, we're getting close. Jay's farm. All right, Jay's farm. What you got here? You just want to... Oh, my gosh. No, you need to do this for yourself. Oh, my goodness. You need these for yourself. I, I sold TNT, so I'm not going to take the TNT, and someone else can have the dynamite in the market. Thank you so much, Jaden, but I don't like taking expansion materials from the lower levels because you guys need those yourself. And then someone else says to come, level 85. <sighs> you guys are just doing this so you get me all excited. I never had so much stuff given to me. Uh, Bavesh, I'm not seeing you. What's your farm name? I'm waiting, Bavesh. I think we want to be like Ricky. <laughs> no, no, we don't want to be like Ricky. Ricky wants to be like us. <laughs> I'm a friend on my baby farm. Uh, I don't think so, Bavash. Because I don't add people on my baby farms. They're support farms. They're safe farms. And you don't add people if you want to keep a farm safe. I'm sorry, I don't think so, Bavesh. I no. He's not on there. Unless I don't see how he could have sneaked on there. Um Your own little fee? Hmm. Hold on everybody while I change farms. I don't like to change farms where everybody can see me. So I will be right back. We have asked Hey Day if they could possibly just let us show our names on here instead of our email addresses. Okay, I'm going into the baby farm now. And you say you're over here, level 85. Nope. You're not on here. You're not on my baby farm either. I don't have a level 85 on here. Nope. No, I don't. I'm sorry. We'll go back to the big farm. That's where all the goodies are. <laughs> I want my goodies. Hold on, everybody. Changing farms again. Logging out. Confirming. Log in. On my big farm. Uh, 
I don't know, Bavesh, I don't know what happened, but I will not add. If you're on Little Fee, I don't have Little Fee connected to the Facebook so I can keep her safe. Uh, so, Leon or, or Leo, are you saying that you bought? Ah. Oh. My big farm tag, uh, it's cleaning up my book today. So if you want to wait until after I finish cleaning up my friend's book. Well, thank you, Julie. Thank you so much. Julie, what level are you? Because I've got a couple of Julies on my friend's bar. Bot working today. <laughs> I tag. Yeah, Bob was working today. Well, hello there, Mr. Rich. How are you doing? I haven't seen you for a couple of weeks, have I? Okay, guys, I, I was so busy. I don't remember which farm I was at last. Look, I got coins. I got coins. Yay. I think I have a few things to sell. Uh, Leo, let me see if I have any I can spare. Ooh. Look, no, I only have 55. I'm going to have to plant those tonight. You you can often find those in the newspaper. Chili pepper, but not when you're looking for them. Take that, and I'll take that. I'll take that. <laughs> Let's see if we can find chili peppers. Stone blocks. Mm. All right, got more stone blocks. I don't remember what level I was on on my bar hopping there, guys. That's it. Go back. Uh, boy. Does anybody know where I was on the bar hopping? I don't think I had made it. Hmm. Let's start there. Somebody's got to collect their diamonds. I don't think they've been on their farm all week. It's a... Uh, Lettuce? I think we've been here, haven't we, guys? Oh, yeah, we've been here. Julie, is this you back here? Julie's farm? I think they should add a chat option in the valley. Uh, can't you chat from the on your hood chat from the valley? I did not try that. I have rows and urns. Should I run them? Well, Leo, I I don't understand how you got to level 114 and you're asking all these beginners questions. Does your mom know, Leo? Maybe you could ask her to help you out. That's not you. Okay, Julie. Are you on my friend's bar, by the way, Julie? I think we were here. We, yeah, we hit Daisy's shop because I got all those tomatoes. Ooh. And I hit that shop. I'm going to take those. Those are hard to get. And you need them to make the uh, one flowers, too. What is the... What's that bouquet called, guys? Our hood chatted from the valley. We helped each other that way. We have also, for our hood, we have a Facebook group messenger. They're very easy to set up, and you can just invite all your friends in. And I think as long as your friend has Facebook messenger, they don't have to have, I don't think they have to have the Facebook, but they can join your messenger that way. I know one of our hood members does not have Facebook, and they're on the messenger service. Still looking, guys. Still looking here. Oh, you know what? I was at level 85. I remember because there was Daryl's shop. I had passed that up. Whoa. That's... Yeah, she got some very expensive wheat. I got to go make the wheat bundles now that I've gotten a lot of wheat. Uh, Jaden, selling farms... 
It's not in the terms of service for heyday. They will ban you in a heartbeat if they know you uh, sold or bought a farm. I mean, they will really ban you. I, yeah, I went through black bears. Going through the same shops again, guys. Okay, I don't think I got this far. Now we're cooking. There, if the heyday knows that you're selling farm, they will take possession of that farm, ban it, and whoever bought that farm will be chasing after you. They would think that you had scammed them. I'm going to take the popcorn. One or two boats and it kills you on popcorn. And I don't like taking it from my neighbors because they need it for their boats. Oops, did you see that? Yay, we bundles. Yay. I'll take that little pink dress. I may be sorry that I didn't take the indigo. Watch next week or when the valley comes back. I said next week. I don't know when it's coming back. But the next valley season. We're probably wishing we all had indigo. Oh, here's, look there. Did you see that, Leo? Oh, look at this, guys. This is Leon. Ah, oh, thank you. <laughs> barn is full. Oh, my gosh. The barn is full. I got to unload some stuff from the barn. <laughs> now, I know where I was this time. Uh, what can we sell here? I'm going to sell some expansion, land expansion, everybody. Sorry, I've been a bother. I would like your pen number to add you as a friend. Uh, it's coming up in just a moment there. HK will show it. And I'm probably way behind the chat here. Um, Jaden, that doesn't make sense. You sold the stuff, now you're buying it back? Hmm. I don't know what I put in there to sell you now, because it just totally threw me off whack here. I don't need all these. What I need right now are permits. Whoa, what was that? We have a new sub, everybody. Josette Paulson. Well, thank you for subbing and welcome to my stream. Uh, if you're in chat, please let us see you. <laughs> uh, let me take these all down to equal numbers. 90, I think that's good. Hold one second. What's wrong with Nightbot? It should be working. Um, sometimes it just takes a little bit of time for not, not, Nightbot to do its thing. Jade, no, not my neighborhood. Well, hello, Patricia. How are you? I'm going to show you something, Jade. Now, this is why you don't ask to join some people's neighborhoods. Oh, somebody's invited me. Team Dare Super Farmer. Oh, let's just take a visit and see who this person is. Level 95. Let's check out their neighborhood. 30 people in it. I don't know why they're inviting me. Oh. Walt Farm tried inviting me twice already this week. Um, I, I'm being very vocal about this, but I think it's kind of rude to invite a neighborhood leader to another neighborhood because if they weren't happy, they wouldn't be in the neighborhood anyway. So I'm declining this. Okay. Um, 
Jaden, can you see this? Our hood rules are this. You must do all tasks at 320. That's all nine tasks, and we always do 10. The whole neighborhood usually does 10. Or do all your tasks at 400 points. We may change our rules depending on the derby type. We may change our strategy somewhat. You must opt in and out. Failure to complete tasks will get you opted out of the next derby. Second failure will get you removed from the hood. And I think there's somebody here in the chat right now that can tell you that we're pretty strict about our rules. No, you can't do that. You can't do that because look what you have to contend with. Level 180, level 147, level 147, 146, 138, 136. See, they we're all at higher levels. And that makes it very difficult for you to have, uh, at your low level, it makes you very difficult for you to have tasks. Uh, we'd all have to work around your t what you could do, and we just couldn't do it. So, and my neighborhood is full, too, by the way. Yeah, check back when you reach, like, maybe level 80. And then you don't have all the products at level 80. You just have the last machine at level 80. Okay, we're going to click from those guys. There's people lower than you in my neighborhood. That's someone's baby farm. Okay. It's maybe there for a purpose. Uh, sometimes it helps having those baby, having someone's baby farm in that will keep releasing their town visitors for everyone else to do their derby task. It's all strategy. Your baby farm's at level 31, right? They don't plan their derbies. Well, thank you, Julie. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. At Frackles, we're 100 and up. Yes. So lower levels. You should go join a neighborhood that is more at your level. And you can search for that. And you do that by going out on a search and tap the advanced options. And then you can, is this the way you can search? Guys, I've never had to do it <laughs> since they added all this. But you can search, oh. There's a neighborhood, <laughs> but I know who that is. <laughs> That's my little grandson's neighborhood, Draggy. He wanted a neighborhood, so I put him in his own neighborhood. He's only, he's going to be six. But just go look at some of these neighborhoods. A lot of these people want someone to join. Anyone can join. The Wolf Pack, anyone can join. Go searching for a neighborhood. I'm sure you will find one that fits you. I guess Peter has left us. But being in a neighborhood with other people is much better than being in a neighborhood by yourself. You have many more advantages. Uh, and here's one of the advantages of being in a neighborhood. Uh, look at all these prizes we're going to be getting. These are all of our rewards when we close that. Ah, oh, hi, Peter. <laughs> these are the rewards that we'll be getting. At the end of the derby, I'm going to get a permit. Of course, I can't claim it now. And I want a permit in this section here, Horseshoe 4860 to 18684. I've got the permit over here, so the chances are pretty good that I'll get a permit over here on this side. Um, but these are, see, when you have a good neighborhood, you can get so many more goodies. I don't really care for derbies or hoods, so I don't mind being alone. <laughs> uh, Peter, just what do you do in that neighborhood all by yourself? Does Katie come and see you there, and you're hiding her from everybody else? <laughs> I need to get back into the derby. Okay, but see, I'm going to have some good rewards. What's this? Ooh, still two crates for 24 hours. I like that. Okay, Bavesh says to come. Who is this that I'm adding? Who is Bunny Acres? I would like to know who Bunny Acres is before I add you. And now I gotta go find Bavesh. 
level 85. But that's you're not leveling up too quickly, are you? Because you were like 80 when you were in my neighborhood. See, even being in a neighborhood helps you a great deal for leveling up as well. You help your Oh, thank you for the boat there, everybody. Uh, what you need here? Oops, I can't do that one, but I can do that. And I can do that for you. And you got something for me? Oh my gosh, look at this. Hello, Rockstar. Look at this. Don't you wish you were in this um, shop here, Rockstar, for all these goodies? Oh, I don't need the lettuce because I had those bukus of those. I'll take the popcorn. Okay, thank you very much, Bavesh. I really appreciate it. Crackles is looking for one or two level 100. And, oops. Oh, Crackles wants someone who is level 100 or higher and they speak English. Is that what you're trying to say, Wilma? Cassie's farmland is my farm. Okay, you are added there, Julie. And I'm still waiting to see who is Bunny Acres. Uh, I just cleaned a bunch of people off my friends bar because I didn't know who they were and I have not seen them in the chat. So I cleaned them up and made a little bit of room. I'd like to know. Peter Katie is messaging me. <laughs> What kind of tools are you wearing there, Leo? <laughs> I added another a person to my friend's bar today who was my grandson-in-law. <laughs> I helped him recover his farm last week. Did you delete my baby farms? I don't know, Leo. I may have. What's the level? And I may not have. Leo the Cub, right there you are. You're sitting on here. You're very welcome, Julie. Thank you so much for wanting to add me as well. Uh, Leo, what's your lowest level? I think I might have your little baby farm on one of my other farms. Sometimes I help Leo transfer 200 more XP. Level 31, I, I'm a, yeah, I have your level 76 on here. I don't know about the 31. I might have removed it a long time ago when I was cleaning my friend's bar up again. Yep, you're not on here. So we'll have to work through your number two farm, Leo, and your number one farm. Uh. <laughs> Looks like HK, it looks like Peter's willing to share KD with you. <laughs> oh, you guys are crazy. <laughs> you have only one big farm. You don't do a, a smaller farm or a baby farm, Bavesh? I, I um, actually wish I had only done one smaller farm. Uh, it's really absorbing a lot of my time. And now with the valley... I'm not going to be able to do it on all three farms. Can I make when? Hmm. Speaking of that, I need to go uh, start making my wheat bundles so they'll be ready for tomorrow morning. Gee, I can do, whoops. Yeah, I'll do one more. You're super... Oh, thank you, Julie. I hope so. I hope that, you know, people can learn. I, I'm kind of, uh, kind of more of a strategic type player. Maybe did you upgrade? No, Leo, no. I, when I get to, I don't know if I have all the stuff yet. Well, let's go look. Leo's going to just die for me to show off my town, which is a major mess right now. Okay, I'll have to collect from some of these people in order to get in and see what I need to do. <sighs> nope, I still need gray stones for this guy. And I think this one may be fully... I'm not Shane Fox out for Peter, don't worry. 
So you're helping Peter out now. <laughs> We had a good discussion about the um, valley, didn't we? Oh, my gift shop is fully expanded now, everybody. That's good. <laughs> see, Peter HK is working with you. He got rid of Jamie Fox. okay? Let's see what we need to do on this one. Okay. <sighs> I'm not going to be doing that for a while because it's taken away from my barn, and my silo. This one, I think I have four of the buildings fully expanded here. Um, I, I could do this, but I don't want to take away from my barn and silo again, because I want to upgrade those first. I prefer having more space so I can Hog more products. <gasps> ba -ba. There, that one is fully expanded. Now you're going to make me have to. I'm not working with him, Phoebe. I'm taking care of that. <laughs> but uh, Peter, you're still working on Gizmo, aren't you? And this one is fully expanded. I think my beach cafe is too. So I just have two buildings left. Oh, thank you, Julie. But I always feel that my farm is a mess. I play on iPads, Apple iPads. And that's fully expanded. So I just have two buildings to go, everybody. And I don't want to do them because they'll take away from my storage. What's the max minutes when you fully expand the uh, grocery store? Let me see here. Maybe I can figure that out myself. Uh, grocery store, where are you? Here we go. Here's a grocery store. Uh, let's... Man, he took that cheese, both of them. 38 minutes, so take 5% off of that. Is it worth taking the grocery store down to 40% off the time? Does anybody know? Would they do it? It's about 35 minutes. Oh, really? I don't think it's really worth that to, to spend my barn expansion materials on it. I don't think it's worth it. I might go for the coins instead. Bye, Bavesh. Thank you so much for coming. I know it's really late in your, is it late or early in your country? I'm maxed out in your town. Yeah, lucky. Well, you're just so lucky for being there so fast. Let me go ahead since I'm here and we'll take care of these little greedy visitors. They eat a lot, don't they guys? Wilma, how long? Oh, thank you very much, Julie. Congratulations on winning the Hay Day Bake Off. That was so much fun that day. If we had not been on a timer, I think we would have done a few little antics with those, that fondant and everything, like wrap up our opponents or something. Well, Daisy, thank you so much for coming to my stream. I appreciate it. Yay. Got some newcomers tonight. This is fun. Don't forget to subscribe, Daisy. Yes, hit that little red subscribe button in there. And don't forget to tap the notification bell at the same time so you'll know whenever I stream. But I do, as a rule, stream every Thursday night at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. And I also stream on Monday mornings at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. And the only reason that you might not see me at that time would be if the uh, paydays and maintenance, like this past 
Monday, I didn't attempt to stream because uh, they were in and out of maintenance so often during that up, uh, date. Ling time, Leo? Long time. Yeah. I hope they have enough shops for them all to go into. And I do. How many people? I've got 35 here. Grocery store is full. Oops. I have the mail for him. Let me see if my hoodies want to help me out. I don't usually do that, but we'll do it. Oh, look what I did. I accidentally sent him away. Ah! <laughs> Darn, why did I do that? Oops. I hit the wrong button, so I did it. That was so much fun. It really was. Um, we kind of each took a t took a different um, different task, I guess we should say, for decorating the cake. Um, Super uh, Sight made himself the designated placer for the. Um, um, I'm going to ask for help. But Super Sight made himself the grand placer for all of the um, <laughs> jelly beans. And this is no joke. He copied the jelly beans in the same color uh, variation that they had on the cake. He <laughs> like if it was a pink jelly bean followed by a blue, he put them in the exact same order that was on the cake. Uh, he did the jelly beans and I did the rolling pin. Them guys are kind of awkward at the rolling pin girls. You know that. So I took over the rolling pin and did all the rolling out. And um, I placed the first layer on. Then after that, uh, Rude and uh, uh, Night, yeah, no, Nighthawk and Ricky did the um, placing it on the cake and shaping it up. And then uh, they worked on the little uh, bows like things they had on the top. It was so much fun doing that, everybody. It really was. So worth it. Did you guys see the other video of us on the farm? Why won't this open? There it goes, finally. The other video of us on the farm, that was, that was fun making that. Of course, they were just following us around the farm and it was fun. Uh, some of them were quite ex <laughs> I, I hate to say this, but a lot of them were quite excited about the farm. I lived on a farm. I was a farm girl, so, you know, I wasn't all that moved. I see I need the beach cafe here. One, two. I need one grocery store. So what we can pick up over here. Ooh, we don't need those. And nobody has anything that I can use here. Ah, we need that. Okay, kind of a wasted trip over here, but I got three for my uh, grocery store. Well, thank you, Julie. Thank you very much. I appreciate all the compliments. You guys are giving me the big head. See, with the big head, you scratch your ear way out here. <laughs> ah, thanks for posting that. There's the farm video, if you guys have not seen it. And... It was a fun day on the farm, though. I'm missing one that I got, didn't I? Oh, I thought I picked up three people for the beach cafe. I guess I didn't. After all, let me go back and see if any of my neighbors have helped me out. Thank you, Rockstar. Thank you very much. And I forgot what all buildings I had, them marked. There we go. Thank you very much, Rockstar. I love my hoodies. I, I've got the greatest hoodies. I kid you guys not. 
who else here in my hood? What do you think about our neighborhood? Happy to hear Luki. Hi, Line. I watched it. It was awesome. Well, thank you, Luki. Luki, if you subscribe to my channel, please hit that little red button. And uh, don't forget to hit the little bell next to it so that you get the notifications. You love farms? You know, the farm's no big deal for me because I really grew up on one. Uh, they had the sheep and they had the chickens, but they didn't have any cows. It would have been so cute if they could have a stable with the horses, just like what we had have on the farm. Ah, Rockstar, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for helping my uh, town visitor, too. I really appreciate that. I we, I think we have the greatest hood. What did I miss here? The gift shop. Okay, how did I miss that? I think we have a great neighborhood. You guys make it great. Every one of you. I hate to get emotional about it, but every time I see how you guys are helping each other out in the neighborhood, they're in the chat and everything, helping with the tasks, with the revives, and just everything you do just makes, I just get all teared up when you do this. Uh, Luki repost your thing for Phoebe, but add her. What did Luki say? Uh, I'll scroll up. I need tips for gaining money. I have too little. You're level 31. Uh, Luki, the best thing to do is to make products uh do we do the crops with by doing they call it weeding uh if you do the weeding for i don't know how many fields you have but you'll get a reward for ever so many fields like there see that i just got a screw if i have any more coming here if you do weeding, it takes two minutes. You can really rack up a lot of tools, and you can sell the wheat. Wheat is selling for full price. I'd sell it all. See, I got tape there. So I got two rewards for doing my uh, collecting on my farm. So that's one thing, weeding. <laughs> wheat. This is weeding right here. Grow wheat. <laughs> so... Uh, just grow as much as you can. Keep selling it for third, for full price. Um, make your products. Let's see, level 51, are you? Or did you say 31? Where did I say 31? You're level 31. Or did you mean 51? <laughs> No, Leo, I'm going to have to move back here and type it in for you guys since you don't know how to spell. There, that's weeding. <laughs> Look, I'm from the South. We Southerners don't speak all of our words right. But at least we can say our English words a lot better than Ricky can because it is not fillets, it is fillet. And what's the other words he says? <laughs> you did mean 31. Okay, make your products. Uh, See, a good one that sells really well is um, don't sell it, it's illegal. <laughs> Watch it, guys. You know what you're doing. You know what? I've been on this almost two hours. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, pancakes is a good one. They sell really fast in the shops. Um, we in the Midwest don't pronounce correctly either. <laughs> we had a conversation in here one night about people from the north like Minnesota, they don't wash their clothes. They wash them. They put an R in some of the words. It's so funny to hear them talk. Phoebe's roasting Ricky. Yeah. <laughs> I always give Ricky trouble. Phoebe's the president and prime minister. <laughs> uh, what's another word that Ricky says? Yeah. Hey, Ricky, we're roasting you. Uh, oh, ponies for peony. Um, Dobby is Derby. <laughs> so, so many funny things. That's Midwest too, Phoebe. You're worse, your clothes. <laughs> when the people from the South, they drop the R's. It was so funny because when that one person said, well, 
Uh, the people in the South drop their R's. We know that the people in the North collected them, and that's where they get wash. <laughs> so I'm going to have to cough here, so I kill this so you guys can't hear me cough. Okie dokie. I think I'm back. <laughs> Ricky says, yeah, he says fillets. And we know it's fillet. <laughs> I found where the R's went. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Were you the one, Terry, that said that? And the, yeah. <laughs> that was so funny. I cracked up over that. We say fillet. Yes, the T is silent. <laughs> In case Ricky doesn't know. <laughs> Let's see what we can find out here. You know, I'm going to have to end this stream. I, <laughs> this has been fun, everybody. It really has been. Uh, I've been here almost two hours, and I usually don't go this long. I'm going to follow you to see your farm. You, uh, look at, did, did I add you as a friend on my friend's bar? My tag is I can find my keys here. Whoa, I did it wrong. There. <laughs> is it there we go? There's my tags, Lookie, so you can join me. Add me on your friends bar if you wish. Wish. Listen to that. I'm starting to talk like the Northerners. Put an R and wish. <laughs> well, guys, I sure hope you did enjoy me. And uh, looky, I just my tags were just posted there. So if you want to add me real quick, I can accept you. I do have. I did add everybody that has asked to join tonight. So take the tags and add me, please, uh, people. It was so much fun tonight. I'm so glad you guys joined me. And uh, I hope to see you Monday morning at 10 a.m. Central Time or Eastern Time on my when I close out the derbies. Uh, a lot of you like to see that. and It's fun sharing. All right, everybody. Good night. Thank you so much, HK uh, and Leo. Thank you guys very much for moderating. It's been super. Love you guys. Bye now.